Hi guys, today I want to discuss on how to install mole template on Mac OS and the image here is courtesy from the mole template website. So mole template, uh, you can do installation by two methods either from GitHub or you can di directly download it and extract the tar file. So if you Google and go to the home page and go to the download, you can see There are two ways, one is from github, you use git clone command to download it directly from the github or you can download directly by clicking here. I click here and I press download allow download from this website and it gets downloaded. So you can do either those two methods. So mole template installation method, uh, method one is like you download directly. And what do you do is, uh, the download file stores in the download folder. So you move the tar file to the home folder. So you don't keep the tar file in the download folder, but you move the mole template tar file to the home folder and then go back to the home folder and you list. You can see that the tar file is here. Now you use the tar minus xvzf command to extract the tar file. So this command will be given in the video description. After you have done that, you press clear and then you change the com folder name to mole template so that it will be very clear, very simple. Later, you go to the mole template folder and you do pip install dot don't forget the dot so the mole template is successfully installed now we go to the second method. In method 2, you download it from GitHub using git clone command. And after you do the git clone, so it's a very easy method to do. Now you see that mole template is already installed very simply. You can go to the mole template folder. I press clear. Now I do pip install dot So the successfully the mole template has been installed Now you export the path so that you can run mole template commands uh, directly so what you do is you export the path of the this is a home folder where the mole template is installed and the mole template is there here and you do these two path exporting so you export the path to the mole template mole template folder and you export the mole template slash mole template slash scripts folder so after you do this Now I want to show an example uh, on butane. So there are many examples given in mole template. Now we will run one of the examples. So I go to the mole template folder, I press list. Now you see examples folder, I go to the examples folder. Now I go to all underscore atom. Now I go to force field underscore OPLS AA. Now I press clear, I press list. Now I go to butane. I press clear, now I press list. So in the list, you can see that there are many folders given here. And this is a directory mole template underscore files. And 
there are two uh, bash scripts that are written so we go to one of the bash script so setup.sh so in the setup.sh you do these three four commands actually so you go to the so first you go to the mole template underscore files then this is a mole template dot sh so this command actually runs the mole template so system dot lt it runs this and generates the required files and whatever files that are generated such as system dot data and system dot in asterisk there are few files of input files so you move both or all these files to the folder back so you have actually changed the directory to this folder now you move these folders back to the butane folder that's what you do so let's run so i want to show you this so there are like uh, in this there are like three four files and the system.lt is a important file here so if you see the system.lt here import butane.lt is written here so if i go back and i open the butane.lt you can see that there the ch2 group and the ch3 group dot lt are there so this is uh, what you have to know here now you go back now i do list clear now I run bash readme underscore setup dot sh so when you run this a series of python scripts as well as some building of templates are being done here so it looks up for the bond types so the it goes to uh, bond by type dot py the python script and it looks for any bond types that it has to create and it generates like a three body angle interactions now it generates a four body dihedral interactions so you can clearly see what commands are being run here and this helps you a lot to understand the working of mole template now the post processing of the file everything is done now i do readme underscore run dot sh so in the run dot sh it actually runs these two commands so we will see how to run it now you can do directly running of the script so after you start running the script like npt or nvt or minimization then it runs for a few amount of time to generate all the files now if you see here if you see the equilibrium npt has been shown here and if you see the simulation cell here on this data source you can see that the box size is reducing constantly and you can see it is contracting so the butane actually we are doing a relaxation process so it is reorienting re uh, expressing itself and it's running so this is how you can uh, do running of example files in, in mole template and Thank you for watching the video. If you like the content of the video, please click on the like button and subscribe to our channel. And if you have any questions, please comment below and it will be very helpful for me to know what questions or what content are you are interested in. And I will make a very uh, likable or similar kind of content based on the comments. And thank you. Have a good day.